Hey, it's Nessa, and I'm here today with a review. A review on three products. And I don't know why I did that. But yeah, for three products. And guess what? They're all bad reviews. Someone says something about how I'm always like, Yay, everything's great. Love everything. I'm not. I can be mean. I tried three new products today, and all three of the new ones that I tried stuck. Suck so bad that it made me angry enough to make a video. So, yay. Okay, so enough talking. Let me tell you about it. Alright, so I'll tell you about it in the order that I use them. My makeup is driving me crazy because I use them today and I hate it. Alright, so, first things first. Okay, now you all know I hate the brand Aziza. I had that one good palette and I should have just stopped right there. Urgh. Maybe it all, Maybe it all doesn't suck, but... I got their liquid liner with the little mirror thing. And look how the brush is already. This is after using it once. And it's like, it gets dry and clumpy and nasty and I try to make it work. But it's, it just does ugh. Don't like it. Ugh. So yeah, I actually am wearing it today. Um, my eyeliner is not even. It's driving me crazy. It's way thicker than I normally would do it. And it took me a long time. And I'm not happy about it. And I keep thinking that my eyes look weird because I could tell that one's thicker than the other. Okay, you guys stop looking, only I could look. But yeah. So, as far as this goes, even though this is only a dollar and it has a little handy dandy mirror on it, do not get it. It's horrible. Urgh. If you see it, just please don't buy it. Please don't. And if someone says it works for them, I think they're lying. No, just kidding. Mine sucked. It could have been old. It could have been just my store, but it sucks. After I got the liner on, I was like, wow, it's all fake and nasty. I'm going to have to put on fake lashes. Well, before I put on fake lashes, let me try this new mascara. I got the Maybelline Lash Stylist. Now, I've actually heard some people like this. Um, I, I don't get it. How, how do you like this? It's like this one-sided comb. Do you see it? Okay. For one thing, I tried it twice. The first time, I kept freaking, like, putting it on backwards because it has to face a certain way since it only has bristles on one side. And that made me angry. And then something happened that really pissed me off. Oh. My. Gosh. I was pissed. You would have heard the shit coming out of my mouth. <gasps> I was doing it. And okay, for one thing, you start putting it on with this stupid thing that's only on one side, and you're putting it on, and it's like, shit, everything's sticking together. It's like it has glue that makes your lashes, like, into three lashes. I was like, fuck. And then I was like, okay, well, there's bristles, so I'm going to keep combing it. I'm going to comb it, and then it's going to be okay, because, and then, ah, fucking pulled out some of my eyelashes. Like, not one, like, more than one. What the fuck? Ah, oh, F word, yeah. You would say the F word too right now. It pulled out multiple eyelashes on that eye. Wow, I hope your volume wasn't loud. So I'm sorry if I was screaming. But oh my god! I'm gonna have like, after my eyelashes are unclumped, I swear I'm gonna have like a big hole of no eyelashes. So yeah, I'm pretty upset about that. I will say it works really good on my lower lashes, but I'm scared to death that it's going to start ripping them out now. I was like, because that's the first time I got them all clumpy, I was like, oh, it works on lower lashes. And then, oh, oh my gosh, what if I pulled them out? I'm just not cool with it. I got this really cheap, and it is not worth me losing eyelashes. And my story's not over. So then I was like, okay, well, I got to put on fake lashes, because my shit's just all, ugh. And then I was like, oh, I'll use this new glue I had. I bought this at the dollar store. Don't buy a glue at the dollar store. For two ninety seven, you could get it at Walmart, and I don't know the brand off my top of my head, but it's two ninety seven at Walmart. It's the cheapest um, eyelash glue. That works so good. I've never had any issues with it. But back to the point. I put on this crap, Select Lash Eyelash Adhesive. I was because I saw it at the dollar store, and I was like, hell yeah, eyelash glue for a dollar. Yeah, so it doesn't work. If you guys have used the e.l.f. glue for your eyelashes, it's worse than that. There's, like, no tackiness at all. Like, not at all. I don't, I don't get what they were thinking. And, 
So yeah, then I had to take off the fake lashes that were just sitting there on top of my nappy, like, five eyelashes that were sticking out from this stuff. And then I had to use this eyeliner again and try to fix it. Why I did not just say F this and go get the actual mascara that I like using and the eyeliner that I like using and actually use that since it's the whole two feet away from me? I don't know. It was like I was pissed and I was like, I'm going to make this work. Ugh. But, yeah, it didn't work out for me. And it makes me mad deep within my heart. And I'm not okay with that. So, yeah. I'd like to, like bring it back with something positive and be like, but on a better note, I tried this and it was great, but I didn't. Oh, here, this is something that doesn't suck. This, um, CoverGirl Advanced Radiance Olay Ingredients, um, foundation stuff that I got, uh, the Dollar Tree. I really like it. So there. But yeah, that's all I have to say. But you want to know something that doesn't suck? My friend Kat. She does videos on YouTube. This is the worst segue ever. But, yeah. My friend Kat on YouTube, her name's Hip Tech Kat. She was, like, one of the first, like, friends I got on YouTube. And she's amazing, and she has great videos, and she's cute and funny, and I love her videos. She's one of those people where as soon as I see she has a new video, I'm just like, Oh, I gotta watch it first. Or I try to save it for last, but then I can't. Yeah. It's one of those. I'm sure you guys know what I mean. So yes, check her out. Hip Tech Cat. I'll put the little information in the sidebar. She's great and she makes me happy. So yeah. She just did a video and I watched it for this, so that's why. That was a horrible segue. I'm sorry about that cat, but I am just about full of fail today and my makeup's full of fail and yep. Yeah. Um I have nothing else to say. Oh, I also didn't tell you guys that my daughter is going to be going on school break because she's in year-round, so she's already been there for a few months. So, they're going to have three weeks off. And I know this sounds like a weird thing that I'm telling you, but there's a point to my story. Your daughter's going to go on break. I think it's like in a week and a half, something like that. But we are going to be doing a contest together. So, I'm really excited. It's going to be really, really fun. She's actually going to be the judge, and it's all about making a look for her to wear for Halloween. I'm not going to tell you all the details. There's an actual theme and blah, 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 blah. If you follow me on Facebook, you might know the theme. But, yes, she's going to be holding a contest. We got all the prizes. She's so excited. So look out for that. It'll be like in two weeks we'll probably do it. So I'm really excited and so is she. But, um, I guess that's all for today. I miss a lot of you that haven't made videos recently. So if you haven't made a video recently, please make one. Because I miss you probably. Yeah. Alright, I'm just rambling about nothing, and this video was full of fail, but if you're still watching this video, thank you, and I'll see you later. Bye.